Good day, everyone. It's Mr. Dino here, and you're in my English class. Welcome, welcome, welcome. For today, I want you to get ready, all right? Prepare your materials, and let's get started. But before that, Today, we are already in unit number four, lesson three. We are still about jobs. As what I told you for the entire unit, we will be talking about jobs. So right here, lesson three and four, we will have new vocabulary, okay? As you can see right here in the picture, there are different pictures already. So. This vocabulary right here, you will be able to see it in our lesson. But before that, I want you to sing with me our song. Ready? That's our song for this entire unit. Now let's get started. You will be reviewing your classwork. Let's see what happens. Let's let's say, uh, let's look at right here whether you get it all correctly. So this is lesson two. This is your worksheet last time. Uh, here you can look at the grammar part. She is a pilot. She isn't a vet. They are firefighters. They aren't nurses. So you look at here in the picture. All you've got to do for number one is to match. All right. Hi, I help animals. What do you think um, is a kind of job that helps animals? Police officer, vet. Or a teacher? You're correct. A vet. Okay, I'm a vet. Now, from three of pictures right here, one is already taken. This number one. She's a vet. Now, let's talk about number two. This is my sister. So it's already here, taken. So this is the sister. What? Is her job police officer a teacher 
She is a teacher. That's correct. And this is my brother. She's a vet. She has a sister. And she has a brother. Her brother is a police officer. He's a police officer. For number two, read and complete. She is a dentist. What do you think? She isn't a nurse. She isn't a nurse. What about number two? He's a firefighter. What should be here in these two um, lines? He, very good. He isn't. A teacher. Very good. Here, I'm. Remember I'm, right? I'm a pilot. So what should be here? There are three lines right here. Three underlines, right? The first one, what do you think? I'm. Very good. I'm not. We cannot say I'm isn't, okay? We can say, I'm not a dentist. Great job. So if you got all these things correctly, great job. I'm very happy for what you have done. Next part will be practice of the vocabulary we've got from lesson one and two before we will go to our next part of the lesson, which will be new vocabulary. Doctor. 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 Nurse. 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 Dentist. Dentist. Teacher. Teacher. Firefighter. Firefighter. Police officer. Police officer. Vet. Vet. Pilot. 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 Okay, now let's look at, I'll show you the picture. I will ask you, what are they doing? What's her job? She's a doctor, great job. What about the next one? A firefighter, great job. Next one. Is she a nurse or a doctor? Or a vet? A nurse, great job. What about... This picture, what's his job? A police officer. A police officer. What about the next one? Look at that. She or he has tiny mirror and brush, toothbrush. What's his job? A dentist. Great job. Next. What's her job? A vet. A vet. Great job. And then, what's her job? A teacher. She is a teacher. And the last one, he is a pilot. So now you can remember all the vocabulary from lesson one and two. Let's sing the song one more time before we go to our next part of the lesson. What do you do? I'm a teacher. I'm a teacher. I'm a teacher. What do you do? I'm a teacher. Everybody say your name. Doctor, what do you do? I'm a doctor. 
So parts of question, the grammar part last time on asking and answering questions about job. So what's, remember the structure, what's plus his or her, his if it is a boy or her if it is a girl, and then plus job. What's her job? Answer should be he or she is a or an, and then a job. Same here. He isn't, she isn't, an. So this is the structure. Let's go to the next question. What are their jobs? They are, or you can say they aren't. And then third one, what's your job? If that's the question, your answer should be, I'm a, and then plus, and then the job. Or you may say similar to this article, a or an, okay? And then here, another answer should be, I'm not a similar article you can use right here. So, what's her job? She is a nurse. She isn't a doctor. Okay, again, what's her job? She isn't a nurse. She is or she isn't a doctor. She's a nurse. She isn't a doctor. What's his job? What's his job? He's a, a pilot. He isn't a police officer. What about the next one? What's her job? She's a vet. She isn't a nurse. She isn't a nurse. What about the next picture? What's her job? What's her job? She is or she's a teacher. She isn't a, a doctor. What's his job? Can somebody guess? He's a firefighter. That's correct. He isn't a teacher. What? And last one. We will skip the song. We just sang it a while ago. We will skip that. And let's go to our new vocabulary. We've got six different new vocabulary today and I want you to get ready because you will be learning new things. Are you ready? Okay, give me a high five one more time. One, look, two, listen, three, be quiet, four, hands on your lap, and number five, sit down straight and comfortably. So the first one right here is, can somebody help me guess? Again, cook, very close. Can someone else? 
Chef. That's correct. It's a chef. Okay, chef. How do you spell chef? C-H-E-F. Okay, that's correct. Nice guess, and you got it all correct. Next one. She has a microphone, and you can see right here, there are notes up there. What do you think is her job? Artist. It's getting close. Okay, let me tell you, it's a singer. Singer. Everybody say, singer. Singer. Okay, how do we spell singer? S-I-N-G-E-R. One more time. S-I-N-G-E-R. What about the next one? Ah, she has glasses. She, she has a chemical in her hands and a glo and gloves. What do you think is her job? Yeah, it's science, but it should be science is a subject, but this one is a person who does the job. What is it? What it? What it is? Or what is it? A scientist. Great job, scientist. How do you spell scientist? S-I-E-N-T-I-S-T, -E -T. scientist, scientist, great job. What about the next one? She has brush and colors. What do you think is her job? Painter, very close. Artist. Great job. Artist. How do we spell artist? A-R-T-I-S-T. -T. Artist. Artist. One more time. Can you say it one more time? Artist. Excellent. Next. Ah, the girl here is... Dancing, what do you think is her job? A dancer, dancer. How do you spell dancer? D-A-N-C-E-R, dancer. Great, how many of you wants to be a dancer? An artist, a singer, a chef. Great. Next. Mm, what do you think is his job? What do you think? What do you think? Magicians? A magician? No. Can someone else guess? Okay, I will give you. His job is an actor, acting in a movie, okay, actor. Okay, so this time I want you to practice the spelling one more time. What's his job? A chef, great, a chef. How do you spell a chef? C-H-E-F, chef. Can you say it aloud? Chef, chef, chef. Great. Next one. What's her job? Singer. Great. How do you spell singer? S I N G E R. Singer. Okay. Can you say it one more time? How do you spell singer? S I N G E R. Yay! Great job. And what's her job? What's her job? She's a scientist. How do you spell a scientist? S I know C. 
I, E, N, T, I, S, T. Scientist. One more time. Scientist. Great job. N. What's his job? Person who draws, who paints, picture. Yes? An artist. How do you spell an artist? A R. Can you help me? Come on. Help me. Come on. A R T I S T. Excellent. And the next one. What's her job? Okay, dancer, yes, correct. But how do you spell it? D A N C E R, great job. And we've got the last one right here. What's his job? I mentioned it a while ago. What's his job? An actor. How do you spell an actor? A. Help me, come on. C. T. O. R. Yay! We are done with the spelling. Now, if you want to review more, you can play this video one more time, okay? Now, let's have spelling practice. Here, number one is already given. Chef. C H E F and the number two singer S I N G E R. Yay! Great job. Nice practice. Number three, scientist S C I E N T I S T. Great. What about number four? Uh, actor? Nope. Actor should be all right here, but it's S. So what should it be? An artist. Great job. A R T I S T. And number five. Dancer, dancer, D A N C E R. Yay, excellent. And the last one we've got. Can you tell me louder, please? Louder, louder. This is now correct. Actor, great job. So A C T O R. Now another, ah, this time no more, no more help. Can someone help me on number one? Okay, artist, A-R-T-I-S-T, great job, A-R-T-I-S-T, excellent, you memorized it already. Number two, scientist. One more time, how do you spell a scientist? S-C-I-E-N-T-I-S-T. -E okay, so you can see here, similar. And then this one, actor. We just spelled it out a while ago. A-C-T-O-R. Chef. C-H-E-F. And then the last one. Come on. Someone help me, please. Okay, a singer. S I N G E R. Singer. Now you can spill it already. I guess you're ready for our work. Before we work, I want you to sing one more time. Stand up. Great. What do you do? I'm a teacher. I'm a teacher. I'm a teacher. What do you do? I'm a teacher. Everybody say your ABC. A, B, C, D. 
doctor, I'm a doctor, I'm a doctor, what do you do? I'm a doctor, everybody listen, you're Press your teeth. What do you do? I'm a carpenter. I'm a carpenter. I'm a carpenter. What do you do? I'm a carpenter. Everybody bang your head. Bang. Great job, everyone. Now I guess you're ready to work. For our classwork today, you have here lesson three, number one. I guess it's only number one. All you've got to do is complete, then write the mystery word. We've got now the mystery word starts from letter D going down right here. Then, after you write all the vocabulary from number one, number two, number three, number four, number five, all you've got to do is to copy the letters from letter D. Next, 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 and write them right here. Okay? After you write, then you've got to circle which of the following picture is the vocabulary of the word mystery right here or the mystery word okay that's it for today i hope you enjoy this work and now i'll give you time to work for it all right and for our next lesson we will be uh, continuing with the grammar part of this lesson number three. We will be using the vocabulary on lesson number three and use them for the grammar part in lesson number four. Okay, that's it. I want to say enjoy and goodbye.